Hi, it's Diane again. I started getting my pages prepped for this um, boho journal that I mentioned in the previous video. And while I was folding my papers, I thought I should just share these with you before I get them into the signatures. And I'm not going to be using all of these in this first journal because there's 18 pages to fold plus ephemera. So I want to show them to you, and I will be making more of these because I have a lot of these Conta Quilt pieces. So I'll, I will be making more. So here's one of them. And I think this kit is even more beautiful than the first one. Again, Sheila scanned in her um, Bohemian, her Indian fabrics. I'm not sure if this is one. It looks like it is, but I don't know if it is. But I know some of the pieces are. So this is a fun one very lively and of course they're white on the back so I'm going to be coloring them somehow oh there it goes <laughs> there it goes again let me just um, open that up so it doesn't notify me again okay so here's the next page very pretty this is a little more somber This one is gorgeous, very vibrant. You could um, print this one again and cut these out and do things, uh, make embellishments with these, so I think that's what I'll do. Also this, I love this, I love the colors, and this would make really good embellishments also. This is one of my favorite um, Bohemian Girl images, and I put her on the cover of um, one of the journals that I made previously. So I'm glad to see her here in this kit. This is one of Sheila's fabrics that she scanned in. Look at the jewels. This is so great. And I like how the music is kind of faded away here so that you can see the background. I like that. Good job, Cheryl, um, Sherry. Here's another piece of fabric, looks like. This is gorgeous. If you can't have the real fabric, at least you can have this, right? It's beautiful. I have a lot of the fabrics, but I don't have this one. Beautiful. They're all beautiful. Little gems on here, sequins or little tiny mirrors or something colors are pretty. This is so pretty. I like the colors that fade into one another. This is some more fabric. It looks like it's patchwork together. You can see the stitches here, the couching or whatever that is. Very pretty. This is one of the bedazzled pieces. To be hard to put anything on these. I don't think they'll, I will do much decorating to these pages. Most of the gypsy images you see are of little children or beautiful women, but I love this one. This older couple, weathered, it's just beautiful. And I love this image. The colors are great. But I love the Gypsy Caravan. Look at the just saturated colors in this. Look at that little milk can that's painted. This is beautiful. It's got some coins here on a chain. There's a fortune teller. More patchwork. Is this the same one? I don't, I don't think so. Let me see. Nope, it's not the same one. Got some birds on this one. 
and some lines to write on. This one has a necklace, beautiful colored jewels, and a pile of jewelry down here. Some more lines to write on. So you could um, put these on the backs of your pages for journaling. You could print this out and then print this on the back. Vibrant colors here. So those are the pages. Now the ephemera, which I've already cut out, this beautiful line of, um, I guess it's embellishment from clothing. One of the little coins, or I'm not sure if it's a coin, but you see them a lot. A tambourine, that's fun. This you can fold and do something with it. This would make a good belly band. Fun embellishment. Journaling card. I love these. Uh, it's like that tiled paper and you have two of them so you can fold those flaps in and have a corner pocket. So those are going to be fun. Gypsy Love Song. A white rose. Beautiful journaling card. This is really pretty. This was one of the papers from the first kit with this peacock. It looks like a beautiful jeweled mosaic. And it makes a lovely journaling card or the back of a library pocket or something. There's another tag that could be a tuck spot. There's another one of those metal pieces. Get three of those. Here's another thing to fold and looks like it, there's a flap on it so that it can be a little envelope. Some tickets. Violin. And another envelope. Remember I said that page would make great embellishments? Well here is a smaller piece of it. Size a little smaller. There's some beads. And this strip. There's another piece of that. And then she gives you book covers and a spine if you want to use that. I may use that sometime, but I'm not in this project. But that makes a beautiful book cover. But you can use this for other things too, and you would make a good pocket. I cut it in half, make a good pocket. Um, or you could, you know, make a side pocket with the whole page, or just trim it down a little bit. Use this as a belly band. Maybe cut, cut the um, foldable sides down if you wanted to, and just make that into a belly band. Or I would probably sew it like that and use it as a pocket. So there's lots of things you can do with this kit and I'm anxious to get started on it so I'm going to get busy. Thanks for watching. Bye!